Hey guys, it's Shea. I'm back with a Dollarama haul. Would you believe that this is my third time filming this? The second time, the first time, I was literally maybe 10 seconds away from finishing and my boyfriend called. And then that's when I remembered Callie G's tip about putting your phone on airplane mode. So I did that. Um, but my Wi-Fi was still on and then I got a messenger call from him. I'm like, oh my gosh. So <laughs> this is the third time I've put on my airplane mode, took off my Wi-Fi, so... I hope um, I don't have to redo this again. But anyways, I just wanted to come on here to share with you guys um, a Dollarama haul that I've... Um, it's kind of collective. It's been over the past couple of weeks and then I went again today. So I just wanted to um, uh, film this and upload it. I haven't gotten a chance to do it before, but um, nonetheless, we can get right into it. So I picked up this 12x12 We Are Memory Keepers um, denim pad. And I was excited to see this here, um, there actually. So the regular price is $16 and I, at first, um, you know, all of their paper pads are $4. At first it was like $4 for only eight sheets, but then I thought about Michael's specialty paper. I know for sure a sheet of this, um, material would never be 50 cents. So I figured, you know, 50 cents for a sheet, that's not bad at all. So I'll just do a quick flip through. I don't know if any of you have seen these, but I just love the papers. They're really bright and fun. This one is just a multicolored um, polka dot. This one here is white stripes. This is pink stripes. A nice coral color. This is yellow. A nice Tiffany blue. These are black or um, dark blue stripes. The white polka dots. And then just a plain sheet of denim. So um, I kind of wish that they included another sheet just so I could stamp or embellish however I wanted to. But nonetheless, still a good find. Um, the next thing I got was this photo album. Now I store my dies in here. Um, and I use the magnetic sheets that Dollar Amos and Dollar Tree sell. And I already have one of these filled up. I haven't filled up every single sheet, but because I am filling up... Um, the album with dyes it gets pretty thick and heavy so I grabbed another one and then I grabbed a few magnetic sheets now these ones here I just cut horizontally and they fit actually I might have to do some altering it says they're six by nine but I'll have to cut them to fit the sleeves um, but these work really well they hold it in place and I like that so I got three of those um, also from Dollarama, I picked up these puffy stickers. These are just owls and they have little party hats. So these would be really good for any birthday themed project. I also picked up a pack of these, um, uh, cat and dog stickers and these are party themed as well. And I just love the designs, the little streamers and the birthday hats. I just thought it was a really cute set for a pocket letter or whatever. And then everyone has seen these. I picked up the paper butterflies. I've passed these so many times and because I've seen them um, getting hauled so many times, I figured, you know what, I'll just pick them up. They're just so pretty. I got the blue, I got the white, the orange, and the pink. And I believe there is one more color, but um, I wasn't able to find it. I think it's just like a light brown. And then I picked up a pack of these rhinestone stickers. They come in strips, but you could cut them if you need individual ones as well. So I got that for $1.50. I picked up some duct tape in this leopard print. And then I also picked up this um, Scotch brand duct tape and it's a little monkeys. And I thought it would just be really cute for Happy Mail. I've seen, I know I've seen a few YouTubers haul these. They're just really nice. This was two dollars, but uh, I think for a brand name, I think that's still a good deal. And then I picked up this pack of twenty-five paper tree bags. Um, I did notice that they had another pack of twenty, the exact same packaging and everything for two dollars. So just be careful when you are purchasing or if you want to purchase these that you're getting the twenty-five and not the twenty. I don't know why that is, but um, you get a few more for the same value. So. I just thought I'd share that. Um, I picked up this little box of wooden embellishments. These are just the flowers. I think I have these already, but I wanted to pick up a few more. And I have these um, 
little craft shapes here. I'm looking for the other, I don't know where it is. Um, these are the flowers and they're just metallic fabric shapes. So I picked that up. Oh, I picked up another pack of the paper butterflies for Happy Mail. And then I picked up this light box. I've seen this so many times and I've passed it. Never wanted to pick it up. And then I saw Tina Epps, um, uh, she posted a haul yesterday and she picked it up and I'm like, okay, I have to. And I haven't seen them recently, so I was kind of getting a little anxious, but I happened to go today and there was one left. This was the last box, so I grabbed it. And I just think it's really nice to customize. It comes with emojis and you can put like your YouTube channel name and have it on your desk while you're filming a video. I just think it's really nice. And you do need batteries for that, but um, for $4, it's still a really good deal. Um, I picked up these stickers for Happy Mail. I haven't seen these before. There were two other designs, but I just thought these two were the cutest. Um, they're really summery unicorns. This one is, has a lot of unicorns on it. And then this one is just like fruits and um, little hearts and gems and stuff. So I thought that was cute. I might have to go back and pick up a few more if I do see it. And I picked up a pack of these Studio G chipboard stickers for friend mail again. I already have a set of these, but I've only seen one Dollar Tree, or sorry, Dollarama have them, so I'm not sure if it's all of them that are getting them, but um, I decided to grab one more. And then I saw Tina Kazarian haul a um, in her haul video, I think she posted yesterday or the day before, she picked up one of these sets of 144 pieces these are the mini wooden craft shapes and i just thought that was a really good deal for four dollars you get so many pieces and look at all the little pieces you get you get houses you get arrows butterflies little birds bicycles and i think i know um dollarama knows that these are pricey so that's why they're four dollars but still um still a really good deal i know any brand name um, for like 10 or 15 pieces would be like two or three bucks so it's still a really good deal um, and then I also picked up a pack of these um, just resealable storage bags I like to put these in the back of my pocket letter if I'm adding in small embellishments like little gems or paper clips so that they're not when the person takes it out of the envelope they're not all over the place they're kept in these little bags and then the person can reuse these bags for whatever they want to um, and I also picked up this pack of decorative beads. I like to put these, actually this is my first time buying them, but I think these would go well in shakers, um, in pocket letters or any, any other projects. Or you could add this to the side of a pocket letter and just kind of like poke a hole and thread some um, ribbon through and you can add a little uh, bottle. And then just a few more things. I did pick up this this is the 4x6 uh, magnetic photo sleeves and I would have picked up more because these fit in perfectly in the photo album that I was showing you but I haven't seen a lot. I think there was only one left so I like these because they're already cut to size but you get two pieces in here and then I would flip it over and just put all my dies on the back. And then another set of the craft shapes. These are the butterflies. And then just a... Um, the twine with the leaves. I picked up another one of those. I like using them in summer projects. And then, <clears throat> I don't think I showed this. I may or may not. Um, I picked up a roll of tulle and I've seen, um, I forget her name, Gloria. I'll link her YouTube channel, um, but she makes really nice tulle bows. So I figured I'd give them a try um, with this. So I wanted to play around with that and then in another video, um, I did mention that I went to the States a couple, uh, it's probably a month now, um, and I picked up a few things from Joanne, so I don't remember if I shared this. If I have, then I apologize, but if not, I'm just going to do a quick flip through. So I got this DCWV Shimmer Pastels Matte Stack, and you get 36 sheets, and when I went, these are 50% off, so I think, I think they were 350 Just do a quick flip through. So a lot of really nice colors for die cutting or like making cards. Even like wedding cards because paper looks so elegant and shiny. 
So I thought that was a good deal. And then I also picked up, again by DCWV, this Playful Pets mat stack. And I don't know if this is an old or a new pad, but I'll do a quick flip through. And it is double-sided, which is nice. And you get some cutouts or cut-aparts. And there is gold foiling as well. I love the little dogs. They're so cute. And then these cut-aparts. I thought were really nice. And then a kitty page. And these little paw prints. And then more bunnies. And then here's another cut apart page for cats. And I like that they included one for dogs and one for cats. Just really nice colors. And I don't have anything like this, so I thought I'd pick it up. And then these are the last pages. So I grabbed that. Oops. And then I picked up these adhesive gems. They're to me, they look holographic, and I don't have anything like this, so I picked this up for a dollar, I think. And then I grabbed this um, Doris embossing folder. This one says Happy Birthday, and I don't have this. Uh, this was $2.47. It might have been even cheaper because I had a coupon, um, like another 30% off your entire purchase, I think. So I got everything for really cheap. And then last but not least, I picked up this Tim Holtz um, Ephemera botanical ephemera pack and I just I've been seeing a lot of hauls with this this is a very old you guys have seen these but I just thought they were really nice for layering and adding on to like vintage themed projects so that's everything that I picked up guys I hope you enjoyed my video and have an amazing day enjoy your weekend um, the weather down here has been really nice it's been really hot earlier in the week and then yesterday we had a or the day before there was a thunderstorm so it kind of cooled everything down, but it's been really nice. It's been comfortable. I can't stand when it's humid. I can't breathe. Um, but this has just been really cool and comfortable weather. So I hope it continues um, to be this comfortable. But hope you guys um, have a great day wherever you are. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.